The Jonas Brothers are on top of the world, bringing down the house at a sold-out Yankee Stadium last night. Kevin, Joe, and Nick, who grew up right before our eyes, have sold 20 million albums, and their music's been streamed more than 13 billion times. Their new release, The Album, is out, and the Jonas Brothers are now embarking on a massive world tour in 20 countries. And their first stop is right here at Yankee Stadium in New York City. I'm very excited. The Jonas Brothers invited us exclusively to go behind the scenes on their tour. Let's go check it out. Hello. Well, hey hello guys. There. What's up, fellas? Welcome, Welcome to our new home. Look at it. Look at this hospitality. We've been expecting you. No, I'm sorry. Come on in. <laughs> Come on in. The band's kicking things off at a venue close to their hearts. You guys have memories of growing up and going to games in the old Yankee Stadium? Yes, we couldn't really afford to come to games, but I think Yankees would donate tickets to a bunch of different churches, and so we would get access to it. And uh, we would sit way up in the nosebleed, so it's full circle to be back here playing a show. Is it true that way back when, 2008 or something, you guys were offered to play Yankee Stadium, and you didn't think you could sell it out, so you turned it down? That is true. We genuinely thought there's no way we could sell this place out. It feels a little bit more special than it would back then. 20-some years almost into our career to be able to have fans that support us this much. The band's performing five albums each night, a celebration of all of their music. We're out there playing 67 songs. It is a gauntlet. This is definitely by far the most ambitious thing we've ever tried to do. Each brother took us on a personal behind-the-scenes tour. First, inside Joe's dressing room. This is my dressing room. This is, and you did, this is amazing. Thank you. You, you yes. designed every little aspect of this yourself. I did, yes. I'd like to have a film, my favorite film, Back to the Future, on the TV. All your goodies. Um, but I've got a bunch of toys and trinkets. I think it's healthy to remind myself, like, to have fun on and off stage. I've got some photos of me and Sophie over here. Should a lot of Simpsons. A lot of Simpsons. Actually, I'm slowly trying to make this room look like the Simpsons living room. But yeah, somebody did Simpson art of me and Sophie. I spent a lot of time in here, so I want to make sure it feels like home. Nick picked up the tour. But this is, you know, where our family watches from. With a trip to the soundboard, where all the magic happens. And we have an amazing crew on this tour. They kind of bring the, the dream to life, make sure it sounds right. It's, it's a big operation, 100 plus people. It's almost mind-blowing to think about that all of that audio at some point is coming right through here. Yes, it all comes through here. And there's also actually the act of picking the songs. You, you create the set list. I spent literally three, four months building this thing out with our team, song by song, where we could tell the story we wanted to tell about the journey we were on at that point in our life and career. Wow. And then Kevin took a center stage for the best view in the house. So welcome to the stage. This There's is Yankee unbelievable. Stadium. This stage is built and broken down every single time we do a show, which is special. And this is our incredible band. Say hi, everybody. What's up, you guys? Nobody gets to do this. Nobody gets no. to stand here like this. So what does it feel you, like? You need to stand here with me. Okay. Come here. So you come out here. And you look out and you realize you're like 50,000 people sold out two nights in a place that we said no to many years ago. We even got to join their pre-show huddle. I say every note matters. I say every person matters. Well, I say what well, we do matters. And then we go, let's get it. We go. So that means you Has anybody ever work. been in the middle of that before? Uh, no. No. Actually. Welcome. I've got a cold, a cold chill going down my spine. Thank oh, you for including you're me. You're now a Jonas brother. Yeah. Oh, I love that. I, have, I really did have an amazing so time. <laughs> and not because everybody, like you see, kept confusing me for a Jonas yeah, Brothers yeah, as I would yeah. walk around. I said, I'm not with them. But they kept saying there's going to be so many surprises. Last night, Jimmy Fallon came out at intermission. Oh, cool. He uh, did karaoke with the audience. Oh, freaking oh, out. You're and they funny. said there's going to be so cute. many. More. There's oh, Jimmy. That's oh, so cool. Good. They, they said there are going to be so many more surprises throughout the tour. And I just I thank you to those guys because they, they really rolled out the red carpet for us. And it was, awesome. uh, it was amazing. They brought you in the huddle, man. It was crazy. It was crazy. Sobo is a Joe Bro. Joe Bro, Sobo. We Jacob Jonas, Sobro. I like Sobro. Okay. That's awesome. I'm in. Way to go. Thank, Thank you, guys. Okay. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.